Hi, Gemini. Welcome back to White Crow Row. This is your weekend reading. My name is Ebony. Welcome back. All right, guys, let's start by clearing your energy for the weekend. Gemini, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Gemini. Let's go. Take a deep breath in through your nose with me. Exhale out of your mouth when you're ready. Inhale. And exhale. All right. How are we doing, gems? Show me. Show me. Show me how. Show me the way. Show me. Okay. Protection. did not flip. You're not alone. You're being looked after by your spirit guides and angels. Protection. Underlying. Communicate. Communicate with others more freely. Speak up. You have a right to be heard. Gemini. Something will require your attention balance. It's time to find balance in your life. What is most important to you? Balance. Let me know if you're dealing with Libra. Okay. All right, Gems. What am I drawing to for you? Try the druid. No. What is this? Spellcaster. Spellcaster. We have the Queen of Pentacles to the Empress in reverse on the split, but the Empress nonetheless. Again, let me know if you're dealing with a Taurus or a Libra. Empress in verse. Some of you need to go outside and meditate. You need to ground your energies, ground yourselves. Get grounded, Gemini. Some of you have Taurus and Libra in your chart, I also felt the need to say. Ones, we are looking forward to the future. We work with the birds. The birds are our messages. Hawks could be six. Uh, blah, blah. Mercury retrograde. Anyway, hawks could be signifiers to you when change could be occurring. They could be serving as kind of like your omens at this time, Gemini. Um, ornithomancy is kind of your thing by the way, uh, paying attention to the flight of birds and their patterns, that sort of thing. You tell omens that way. Nine of Cups in verse. Genie in a bottle. Aladdin. What will bring in my wish fulfillment? Something I feel like you've been waiting for. Where should Gemini focus for the weekend? The Four of Swords. Meditating. We're home. Meditating, grounding, and protection. So he's being guarded. See all this protection around him by his spirit guides? These wolves, 
the wolf is significant to somebody. Protection. Protection. Where you should not focus. The Page of Cups. Page of Cups. On our immature feelings. There's also a little bit of selfishness here. Maybe self-gratification, immaturity, not considering the um, emotional opinions of others, not thinking about others, not considering how our actions contribute or are felt by others. This could be, again, how others are treating you, Gemini. They're not they're not taking your feelings into consideration. You feel unheard, unfelt. What is the three of wands? The chariot with the lotus flower. The love offer. Love. From a distance, travel. Some of you could be traveling or you're contemplating travel. Let me know if you're dealing with a cancer. So let's back in the chariot, please. Mm. That's an interesting combo. The devil. <laughs> the Diablo. Backing the chariot. What a combo. All right. Straight up, that could just be a Capricorn, you know? Um, this could also be to do, I feel like, with uh, Saturn lessons, things that we've learned from the past. It's also about our forward movement and ascension. With the chariot here, the devil, is hard lessons that we've learned. This is also work. Some of you are addicted to your work or you are addicted to some sort of travel or you're addicted to a cancer. I don't know. <laughs> There's some... What is the devil? Show me that. Work. Work. But it's five of pentacles in reverse is money recuperation. Some of you quite literally turned someone away or someone was turned away someone was turned away by your dogs by your dogs hmm, interesting I feel like they came to your door and your dogs turned them away someone tried to return to you Interesting. Or they will. If you hear your dogs barking at the door, you'll understand why. Dogs. Right? Protection. In the home, like in the four walls of your own mind here, there's some sort of protection going on. Someone could try to return to you over the weekend. Someone could try to come back around. We are in Mercury retrograde, so, you know, do you want this? You're being told to protect, protect. You are not alone. The Hierophant in reverse. Taurus energy. Ooh, I don't like this Hierophant. I don't know. And the Knight of Cups. Someone... has broken the tradition of their beliefs, core values, or quite literally a marriage here, and they are traveling to see you. But there's some level of taboo here, right? It was It's taboo for this person to engage with you, or vice versa. Confirmation. It's taboo here. Five. 
five. Five. Fives are significant. Mm -hmm. Two of swords. We're unsure. You're not sure. You're undecided and you're not sure. There's a sense of you kind of blocking though. Someone's being blocked. You're blocking. Blocking an advance, an attack from behind. You might not see this person or this thing coming right up behind you. Mm -hmm. Something very significant with the dogs here too. So be careful. Pay attention to your dogs. Your dogs are your indication here. We don't want to sit back into any immaturity. Someone who's acting immature. Someone could be just be out partying, out drinking this weekend, and they see you. Possibly where you work. Am I? They see you somehow. The world. The world. Cycle in reverse, too. That cycle is like hasn't closed or it was reopened by someone or it's trying to be closed out the world or someone literally sees you like online you could work online the world bigger issues or the world is seeing you i don't know uh what's the world thank you something that took a really long time to get here the knight of pentacles Traveled from far, far away, and the wheel of fortune, fate, coming in here. It was funny, I was kind of anticipating a tower moment for you. Oh, lordy lord. Someone's predicting it, too. Someone's prediction came true. What is the world? The Nine of Cups comes out in the upright now. Someone's hoping that they're successful in talking to you, either online or face to face. Someone's hopeful that they get to see you. It's like it almost bring them a wish fulfillment, some sort of pleasure. 144 on the timestamp as I say that. 144 is significant if you know why. You know why. Advice for Gemini. Thank you. King of Wands in the verse. What about this King of Wands? They're coming in to talk. They're coming in to talk. Knight of Swords. But they're not standing in a good place. I don't know if I like their energy, Gemini. If this is you. Oh. Oh. Three of swords to the hermit. This person may leave something behind just to have an excuse to come talk to you. But I knew it. Someone wants to have a conversation. Two of Cups. They want to have a conversation. I feel like someone's going to make some sort of excuse. They literally leave something behind just in order to enable them to be able to stay around to talk to you. Or they use that as their excuse to come in and talk to you. I don't know. The white buffalo is significant here. I've been seeing it everywhere. The white Buffalo. Also, um, protection. I feel the need to say this person could be coming in like your champion. Now, careful. That could be, you know, Knight of Swords here. That could be a police officer. So, be careful if you're going out this weekend. I feel the need to say more confirmation. Just be careful. Chariot. Someone's car, I'm feeling like, could get searched. Yeah, careful. Careful traveling. In fact, I just wouldn't make plans to do too much traveling right now. Not during Mercury retrograde. But careful, yeah. If you're, if, if you're, on a weird note, if someone's smuggling something, just saying. Alright. You have a potential of someone, someone's, 
car could get searched. I just felt the need to say that, okay? I don't normally get that message. Um, yeah, like there's a plant here being carded. You know what I mean? That's for somebody. That's for somebody. Careful. Blue light special. Someone also, I feel like, works in law, in law enforcement, or is like Secret Service. <laughs> I always get this message for you, like someone is undercover. Someone you're talking to, Gemini, or you? You're undercover? I don't know. It's so weird. Anyway. <laughs> you're undercover. Acceptance. Alright, pulling a Magdalene Oracle for you, Gemini. Giving you a Magdalene code. What is Gemini's Magdalene code? Hello. Yeah. Well, well, well. We have love, Gemini. Love. And family. Love and marriage, love and marriage. My sound just got messed up just now. So I'm sorry. Okay, love. A beautiful relationship will soon develop. This relationship will continue to grow for many years to come, and endless blessings will stem from it. Appreciate and savor each moment together, and always keep the flame of love alight in your heart, for love is a magnet. You cannot help but attract love when you have love in your heart. If you are already in a meaningful relationship, then your relationship will deepen provided you are always open with each other and are receptive to one another's needs. Always express any insecurity you have with your partner and you will find that your relationship continues to strengthen. For some of you that is, that is quite literally talking about your insecurities. I'm afraid of the disconnect. I'm afraid of that disconnect I feel also when you're gone. How interesting. Gemini. That is your weekend message, and I'm leaving it right there. I hope you are well. Take care, my friends. Happy birthday, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.